Hey everyone, so I've been using Trey, Cursor, and Winsor for a while now. These are three AI-powered code editors. I'll explain what each one is, then break down which is best for what. Let's dive in. First up, I have Trey. It's made by ByteDance, yup, the TikTok folks. And it's a full-on coding environment. Like a super smart version of VS Code, it uses top AI models like Claude 3.5 and GPT-4 to help you write code fast. And the best part, it's totally free. Perfect if you want a powerful, no-cost tool. Next up, we have Cursor. This one's all about being easy to use. It's built on VS Code 2 with AI that writes code right in your editor and a chat feature to tweak it. It's got a free version, but you can pay for faster, fancier stuff. Great if you love a simple, friendly vibe. Last up, we have Windsurf from Codium. It's designed to feel effortless with AI that really gets your project, like suggesting fixes based on your whole code base. It's free to start with a credit system for extra features, and it's big on keeping your data private. Awesome for beginners or privacy fans. So, how do they stack up? Trey's got the edge for power and price. It's free and loaded with features. Cursor shines for ease of use, especially if you're okay paying a bit more for speed. And Windsurf stands out for privacy and simplicity, perfect if you're new or cautious about data. Which one wins? Depends on you. Pick Trey if you want a free, heavy-duty editor. Go Cursor if you love a smooth, user-friendly experience. Choose Windsurf if privacy and a gentle learning curve matter most. That's it, guys. Trey for power, Cursor for ease, and Windsurf for privacy. Let me know what you'd try in the comments. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.